Oh, right, Emma. Right, we wanted to uh, have you go adventuring in the ghost world, didn't we? But let's chat first. What is it, Father? How are your studies? Magic spells are used to borrow the power of nature. Okay. Cool. I guess that's how that works. Adventure time! To the Spirit Forge, of course. Because I guarantee you there will be some sort of thing happening there that she can take care of. Guaranteed. Without a doubt. Although we should definitely make sure to try to not kill anything because her morality is already kind of at the uh, low end of the spectrum. A disembodied spirit. Let's. No, no. Let's talk to it. Emma attempted to talk with the disembodied spirit. Fight avoided. Awesome. The ghost has appeared. Let's talk to the ghost. Please be afraid of me. Sure. Ah, run away. Great. Perfect. chasing you you're so annoying whenever I feel the aching of these wounds you gave me I remember your face and then the pain becomes oddly comfortable so I can't give up on searching for you what do you think isn't that something like love no, no, it's, it is, this feeling is love, I finally realize it, I am in love with you. Huh? Love is a wonderful feeling, even the pain of these wounds is turned to pleasure. My eye, my ear, and the other wounds I receive from you. Those are all presents for you. An offering from me. We'll never be separated again. I'll always be with you. Come. Come mine. If it's for you, I don't care if my limbs are ripped off. So come. Throw yourself into my arms. What are you saying? There's no way I could come to, like, you? Don't say something so stupid. Why? When you know I love you, why will you not be mine? Hey, look. Have you completely lost it? have time to mess around with you. Let's get this fight over with. Do you not understand my feelings? Then there is no other way. I'll make you mine by force. If you receive the same wounds as me, perhaps you'll embrace my love. Never. <laughs> I wonder. Okay, it doesn't look like a pushover. Rain of sparks. 
Okay, maybe a pushover. All right, let's start by analyzing this. Great. Ooh, yikes. Uh, can we like just uh, bind him real quick? Yeah, hopefully he's not like into that. Great, okay. Also, let's uh, just skill up with some dancing, I'd say. Great. Whoa. Oi. Alright. 90, get him. <laughs> Easy. Ooh. Oh, I didn't mean to punch him in the face. Yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, well, one more hit ought to do it. There we go. Yato is defeated. I got an herb. <sighs> My foot! My foot! Give up already! <laughs> Good. I won't give up. He ran away yet again. He really is a creep. Obtain the mirror of the sun. Cool. This could it be? A door. That's right after all. Then maybe I me use the mirror of the sun. The door vanished without a trace. As I thought. There's another path through here. I feel a bit uneasy about it, but uh, which path should I take? Take the fork. Yeah, I feel like there's something in that direction. Alright, first real quick. Uh, items. Heal up. We'll just use the band-aids. So I think they're fairly low yield items, so it's best to use them right here outside of combat. Where we don't need to worry at all about kind of using up a turn to heal. And that should be close enough. If anything's gonna kill her at 850, that wouldn't have, eight, have at 878, then frankly we're just not good enough. So it looks like we're heading up to like a mansion of some kind, I'd presume, from this fence situation here. Also, it's sunny, which is interesting for the for fortress of spirits. Oh, a disembodied spirit. Oi! Rude! Let's talk. <laughs> Fight avoided. Perfect. Oh, what have we here? Looks like we are now entering a courtyard of some kind. What will be here? A ghost of some kind? I don't know. Hmm. There's someone there. Come out. Were you pleased with my Nepage? Nepage? How does the spirit that possessed Takeda Sensei? I am known as Kenpi. Other people seem to enjoy adding another name onto that. It is a pleasure to meet you, Princess Candidate. You're very polite. Are you the mastermind behind all of this? Mastermind? It's as if you think we're villains. Anyone who would send an assassin is certainly a villain, especially since I haven't done anything. The other Princess Candidates, my parents, everyone. They were all innocent too, but they were killed. It is not something that can be measured 
by normal standards. The erasure was for the good of the entire universe. Even if you cannot see it now, our actions will carry much significance in the long term. All that you just said, it doesn't change the fact that it's plainly murder. Dear me, are you truly the last princess candidate? What a brutish manner of speaking. For all we've done, it seems it will end before your true nature arises. It seems that that person in heaven has overestimated you. That person? There's no reason for you to know. This is then for you. I'll send you to meet your parents. Zero HP. So that's, I guess that means we have to win on fighting spirit, reducing fighting spirits. Well, let's just start with the, the old standard. Analyze. Okay. Should we dance? Probably not. He's probably gonna use mostly magic runes. The dodging won't really come in handy. All right. Let's see uh, what type, type of damage this spell does. All right. Thirty points of fighting spirit damage. So we only need to do that what four more times. No, three more times, actually. Oh, yeah. No problem. Heck, yeah, we could even uh, bind him. Okay. Go. Alright. Still unable to act. Sorry. And yeah, let's finish this off with music. Oh, darn. Okay, fine. We'll finish this off this time with music. Alright, that's zero fighting spirits. Um. So he's at zero fighting spirits and zero HP. No. Okay, he lost all five. There we go. Can be the sound was defeated. Great. Oh wow, that's all the end. Nice. Oh, a healing herb. Nice. Ancient milk. Great. This item cannot be used during an adventure. I take the responsibility of it and bring it to the house. I see, I s now I guess I was mistaken. For all your talk, that was certainly easy. Answer me, girl. Why are you fighting us? Eh? That's... You guys are bad? If it wasn't for what you've done, I wouldn't be doing this. You got here without any convictions. Ha! <laughs> For this girl to be the princess candidate. What do you. He disappeared. I was going to did say it, but I guess the true mastermind really is in heaven. You. D you defeated can be the scent. Impressive. Eh, you are... I have watched all of your struggles. I have high hopes for you in the future. Goodbye. Wait! Just, who the heck are you? He's gone. It's the same thing every time. 
Obtain the demon's ring. Nice. Okay. A mysterious ring from the realm of hell. Plus ten charm. Our uh, music skill has increased. Okay, popularity has increased. Nice. Got fatigue. Uh, Rally dropped to... Uh, still in the positive. Still in the positive. Well, I mean, that just starts to be eventful. Uh, you should probably go to sleep now. I'm getting a little sleepy. Go to sleep. You ready to go to bed? Good night. Okay. I'm going now. Alright, high spirits at the school. You're a great help around here. I'll be increasing your honorium from now here on. I'll be counting on you. Okay, five hundred yen now. The pool will finally open today. Class, has everyone warmed up yet? If so, let's go. And we're in. You look amazing in a swimsuit. It's decided this month's front cover story is Emma's gravure debut. Yeah, hopefully not. Senpai? Ah, uh, Gravdgur. What is for us to see you here? So I wonder if there's any major significance to the, uh, what, like, the demon ring or whatever? Oh, uh, maybe if we had that when we summoned the demon king, maybe that would have done something cool. I don't know, probably not, who knows. Well, I certainly don't. This week's session was really full, so I'm really tired. Alright. Good morning. I'm still a bit sleepy. One master, the only lady doesn't look so well tonight. Make sure she doesn't overdo it. This week on the Fashion Radar, unanimously the most popular fashion fashion item is sneakers. Today's sneakers is steadily on the rise. Huh, already have this. Hmm. What an interesting comeback. Alright, man, she is popular with the old charisma. Can I talk to you for a moment, Father? Father, how does thank you for being so kind to me, even though I'm not your real daughter. I truly thank you from the bottom of my heart. Today's Father's Day, so I got your present to show my love. I hope you always continue to be so cheerful and cool. You're the only father for me. Ah, oh, Yellow Rose. Thank you, Emma. Thank you. Alright. Alright, so first I wanted to take a look at the adventure. The Abyss. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Uh, we won't go there today. I want her morale to go up a bit more. And I also want uh, to deal with the stress for the moment. Let's chat, Emma. Okay, we won't chat then, sure. Let's go out. Um, father, you know, there's 
This place I'd like to go. You want to go to the apartment building? Because you, you're fighting with your friends. Well, so called friends, anyways. Okay. It's been a while since we've been here. Hello, is this yet some here? We will grab some of things for coming all this way, but I'm afraid the only lady is sick and lying down. I'm terribly sorry, but please leave for today. Uh, so boring. Okay. I forget. Where is uh? That's. I don't think we actually know where Kuroda lives. Eh, weird. I wonder if we can catch Aya here. There we go. Oh, Aya Chan! Hello! Oh, Oni Chan! Hello! I really love this park. I always have a hard time deciding what to play. Morality, oh yeah, going up. Okay, now what? Uh, I don't think the beach thing is still happening. Oh, that was clamming. Hmm, should we? Sure. Alright, uh, right, that's gonna be the perfect side dish for tonight. Alright, we should go to the hospital. Yeah, like the main thing we wants it to do today. I really lift up your shirt. Looks to me like you just went out maybe would have called as well. Treatments! <laughs> oh my gosh. And receive treatments. It takes time to recover your physical health. Just take things day by day. It's getting late, so let's go home. Alright, I'm out. Can we chat? No, we can't. We gotta sleep, Emma. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. Go to sleep. Alright, I should go to bed. Good night. Okay. I'm going now. I better school in high spirits. Okay, we come on. Can we go some? Good morning. Ah. I suppose if I really wanted Murad to go up, I could drop one of the maid cafe shifts. Place of that a normal cafe. That could work. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's uh, a spire? Hmm, I see. Cool. <laughs> You worry too much, G. Cool, cool. Ah, I got it. I got it. So please stop treating me like a child. I'll make sure to consider it properly. What is he doing? Talking with a pigeon? Greet him! Yeah, I guess I should greet him properly after all. Hello, Esper. Hmm? Ah, oh, Emma. 
What a coincidence. Please leave for now, G. I'd like to talk to this girl. Cool. What's wrong? You've got a strange look on your face. Were you talking to the pigeon just now? What? He saw that. Ah, uh, well. I can talk to pigeons. <laughs> You're so strange. You came at a good time. I have more free time than I know what to do with. Let's walk around for a bit. Is that fine? Well, whatever you say. You have no power to veto it. What? <laughs> Such a forceful invitation. And it's the first time we've been out. Well, that's fine. Let's go to the shopping district. Alright. I'll leave it to you. I was spent some time walking with Aspa. Interesting. I guess they're getting along nicely. This week's schedule is really full, so I'm a bit. so I'm really tired. You wouldn't father, it feels great today. Oh, Master Sing Long Lady so energetic just takes all the words off my mind. Should we send her to hell? That sounds really awful out of context. What is it, Father? Let's talk about your day yourself. I can see things that others can't. Is this what they call having spiritual powers? I don't know, maybe. Any uh, events happening? Uh, it's June currently. So who's like all of these are like, for July and later? Uh, oh, the Return of the Prince. Oh, we should uh, see that. Yeah, you want to go to the apartment building, but uh, we won't. What we will do is you're gonna go to the Children's Park. Crabson, hello. Matsu, Matsu Nagana sensei, hello. The weather's nice today, so I decided to take a walk in the park. Okay, great. Ah, yeah. Ah, oh, Aya-chan, hello. Oh, Oni-chan, hello. I really love this park. I always have a hard time deciding what to play. More morality. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Perfect. Okay. And then after that, how about a, good, a bit of a, a film? Lord of the Necklaces, The Return of the Prince. We can look around. There's movies here. Who would have thought? Enjoy the movie. The movie was fantastic. It's like, it's exciting to see a world like that. Oh, uh, Kazuki. Ah, oh, Kazuki san, hello. Ah, craft, what a coincidence. I try to limit myself to movies when I have time off to study their acting. Cool. Alright. What else? You stop by the theatrical group, troop, whatever. Uh, I don't know. Hang out at the office building. Oh, Griff's a hand. Edison, hello. As you can see, I'm working today. Well, Sunday's typically pretty boring, though. Are you a classmate of the young lady from the Huskoff family? You shouldn't say anything about your part time job if you want the old lady to think well of you. Yeah, I wonder why. Can wait till it's home. Sure thing, cube. Anything you say, sure, whatever. Let's go to sleep. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. Go to sleep. Right as you can, bud. Good night. 
Okay. Dual power is almost to 1,000. I'm going now. How about school in high spirits? The only way to go to school. Let me help. Oh, who's got some? My, it's Crabson. What a coincidence to meet here. Chance to end up with you like this in the morning. I already tell that it's going to be a good day. Okay. great again today. Maybe I'll stop by the park. The stand isn't here today. Come to think of it, uh, this is where I met that foreign boy. Maybe I'll see him again if I stay here. <sighs> There's no way something like that would happen. Huh? <laughs> I was right. I thought I might see you again if I came here. That's funny. I was thinking that too. I couldn't hear you. No, it's nothing. Anyways, did you slip out again? Yes. That's uh, something I need to search for, so I was looking for you. Me? Uh, um... Oh, right. We still haven't been introduced. I'm Roche Wafers. What's your name? Emma, uh, Roshan. Emma, huh? That's a wonderful name. And please, just call me Rosh. Uh, thank you. So, um, what did you want with me? I want your help looking for something. What is it? A blue bottle. Oh, I've seen one in my hometown, and I believe it comes from Japan. A blue bottle? Yes. When I came to Japan, I felt that I had to buy that bottle no matter what. But with me being so ignorant of Japanese customs, I'm not really able to go shopping. I don't think the problem is being unfamiliar with Japanese customs. And I have absolutely no idea where to look. Uh, would you help me? Mm, let me think. Sure, help him. Why not? Tungit has a part-time job scheduled at this time. If you have preference to helping Roche, the other plans will be cancelled. What would you like to do? Uh, yeah, help anyway, sure. Alright, I'll help you. Really? <laughs> Thank you, Emma. The neighboring town is larger, so I'm sure we can find it there. Let's go. No, you couldn't find it. Can you think of anywhere else it might be? The saying goes that things are usually right into your feet. Why don't we go to the shopping district? The oh, shopping district. It's not here. It's not here either. 
It's very important to me, but it seems it may not be so easy to find. Is it something old by any chance? Yes, I think so. Let's visit the man at the bookstore then. If you're looking for something old like that, try the pawn shop. The pawn shop? Where is that? In the back streets in the neighboring town. Uh, be careful. Thank you very much. Huh. Looks like it's probably not here either. Yeah. Hmm. Huh? Ah, there. That's it, isn't it? Uh, there in the back of the shelf? Yes! That's it. Thank you. Thank you. Emma. Thank you. Alright, let's go buy it then. Excuse me, how much is that? I'm very sorry, but that's not for sale. Eh? I'm absolutely certain that you won't part with it. Yes, I have my reasons. Sorry, but I cannot sell it to you. No way. Shape is slightly different, but it's definitely the same bottle I thought I had finally found it. Are you saying you've seen a bottle that's just like this? Yes, in my hometown, at my grandmother. Oh, I see. To tell the truth, this bottle is actually a part of a pair. Did you know that? No. And you say that you've seen the other in the set? Are you certain? I don't know. But the depth and uh, transparency of the color as well as the rustic yet warm film from the bottle is exactly the same as the one I've seen. I see. Then this is yours. Take it. Really? Thank you very much. Uh, how much do you want? No, I don't want any money for it. If I were to take money from someone who had a connection to it, my dead father would haunt me the rest of my life. No, no please. Let me pay you. It means a lot to me I, to actually buy it. Oh, I see. Long ago, someone came in here, sang some of the things, and bought the sisters to that bottle. Back then, the manager of the store was my father. Perhaps this is fate. Well, very well. I'll honor your request. Thank you very much. That's great. Oh, right. Uh, you probably can't use your card here, right? Is that going to be okay? Oh, of course. Uh, I made sure to bring cash today. Look. What? There's so much. Put it away. Did I do something wrong? Thanks to you, I managed to find it in no time. I'm glad I could help. Seeing you so pleased about it makes me happy too. It must be really important. It's a memento to my grandmother. Your grandmother? Yes, that has a very important meaning to me. The wonderful eyes and that bright smile, just like my grandmother. Huh? Perhaps my grandmother planned this from the start. Emma, could I meet you again? He's staring at me so seriously, I... Sure, I guess. Sure, that would be great. I was also thinking that it would be nice to meet you here again. Really? Thank you, Emma. Today was the best day ever. Yeah. Well, I'm going to head home. I'll be looking forward to seeing you again. Yeah, take care. Rush left. Ah, I forgot to ask when we would meet up. Hmm. Man, she is getting all sorts of events with these weird, strange, like foreign boys. All of a sudden, I'm not quite certain why. <laughs>